morning and welcome to This is Another Day. Today's scripture reading comes from Proverbs chapter 28, verse 5. Evil people don't understand the importance of justice, but those who follow the Lord are much more concerned about it. The term social justice is equivalent to the term human rights. Social justice is essentially the conviction of fairness within a society, fairness in health care, protecting people with disabilities, protecting people from discrimination, promoting equitable education and economic opportunities, protecting the environment, and much more. Social justice involves treating those around you with dignity and decency, recognizing that all are made in the image of God, just like you. Scripture dictates a way of life in which people do everything they can to ensure that others are treated well and injustices are fixed. Author and pastor Adam R. Taylor wrote, the prophets of the Bible didn't spend time blaming or demonizing people for their poverty. Instead, They challenged rulers, leaders, and even systems that cause and perpetuate the very conditions that cause poverty and suffering. The effects of social justice have an impact on the lives of people in powerful and dynamic ways, from their psychological well-being to their economic security. This is another day to be God's justice bearers in our everyday lives. We can begin by examining our own lives to see where we are not imparting to all human beings the same rights and opportunities. For example, opportunities for others to be heard and listened to, opportunities to offer compassion instead of reproach. Searching within our own selves for where our prejudices, biases, and intolerances may be lurking is an uncomfortable undertaking. But whether or not we acknowledge them, they exist. Restoration and soul repair is beckoning if we are brave enough to truly face ourselves. So Lord, Today, please strengthen our resistance when evil injustice beckons to us. For as 1 John 4 verse 4 tells us, we know that the God who is in our hearts is stronger than any evil teacher in this wicked world. Thanks for joining me today, and I hope to see you again. Bye.